just trim and uh, after that go to settings and then uh, click on the controller all of this option you have to disable those and bit after disable this options then go to the library select uh, your truck simulator tool and uh, go to the manage and properties and there it is uh, click on the controller and uh, use default settings don't use others only use uh, default settings okay that's it and close it now open the your truck simulator okay Escape button and go to the options, controls. After use default settings, these two settings automatically set up and no need to change. But you can change the transmission type. Simple automatic to automatic sequential uh, shifter. This is totally up to you. Okay. Steering sensitivity on the person. Steering non linearity to the person. Okay. Everything's looking like this. After this, go to the cruise and buttons. You can change the keys whatever you want and it's totally up to you any keys any actions you can choose no nothing uh, problems no problems everything work well and uh, I set up already you can set up as your own okay see internal camera joy bay look forward joy to head switch off look right switch right to look left switch left okay okay after this assign the keys you let's test is it working properly or not okay now we can test the uh, B PB uh, interior camera see it's working very well okay and uh, interior look, look left right forward okay now um, light horn Okay, parking right. I hope after this one you can uh, can drive your truck solo smoothly and uh, any kind of pills you can sign. 
Long Jumps. Okay, yes. That's it. If any problem, you can leave me a comment if it doesn't work. Then I will try to do the solution. Okay. Let us try some. Okay. That's when you get up. Okay guys, thank you for watching. If you find anything something useful, please leave me a comment, like and share, and subscribe. Thank you guys. Thank you.